Yo, what's good? It's almost the new year. It's time to finally do this video that I've been thinking about doing since episode 110 of Dragon Ball Super. Is Jiren angel level? And thus is Ultra Instinct Son Goku angel level. Now, in quick, I would like to say, yes, I absolutely believe that. And I held off for a lot of reasons as to why I did not do the video when it first came out. I'm like, hmm... Let, let me not jump the gun. I was hyped as hell. I ain't gonna like that. That episode was the best episode in the series, uh, in Dragon Ball Super portion of Dragon Ball so far, thus far. Most of Oh, the turn of the power, absolutely. It's the it's best, best episode. I will argue the best episode in, in Dragon Ball Super. Anyways, when you look at all the evidence compiled, and yes, I know evidence is coming out. Um, you know, fights with Vegeta, another fight with Son Goku, maybe another or fight with Golden Freezer. We shall see. You look at the evidence of Jiren. Jiren, as many in the Dragon Ball community have talked about plethora of times in videos and whatnot over the last, I don't know, three, four months it's been, or however long it's been, I think three months, he was suppressed. Even against Ultra Instinct, he was suppressing. Ultra Instinct was continuing to evolve, and Jiren was outputting more power. This man was glaring away. A <laughs> extraordinarily powerful spirit bomb. All right? As people say, the Ginky Dama. You look at it, this man is said to be beyond, you know, more powerful than a god of destruction, Bermut, you know, Belmont, however you say his name. And... When you look at the evidence, they already were questioning, you know, challenging, at least in the anime, a Lord Beerus. Now, you could say in the manga it's a little bit different, but also it's a different continuity, so it is what it is. Son Goku and Vegeta were already knocking on that door, along with Android 17, um, Golden, True Golden Frieza, as well as uh, Hit. All, right? all of them were already god level. They were God of Destruction level already. People want to argue that they weren't. They were. They were. Not everybody, like we say there's levels to shit. Within even a own levels, there are people superior and inferior. You trying to tell me that Son Goku and Vegeta couldn't take out Sidra? Come on now, y'all. You were trying to tell me they can't take out some of those Gods of Destruction? Come on now, y'all. Come on now, y'all. I think they could have taken out Healy's, uh Universe 2 God of Destruction. Um, shoot. Who were some of them? Maybe, uh, Moscato? Or was that one of the angels? But the universe, uh, three god of destruction. Um, it looked like Bermud, um, Lord Beerus, and Quintella seem to be the most powerful. Chomp is pretty good in his own right. He's up there. And, you know, you got Liquor, uh, universe four god of destruction, Gene, and a few others. All right. That are, that are up there. But from the looks of it. Ultra Instinct is a technique that is difficult for even the gods of destruction to do. And Angel Level. Look. Again there are levels. All right? And even within a level does not mean you're on the same level as another one. You tell me that Angel. The chick from Universe 10. You know the cute look, looking one. You tell me she's on the same level as Whis and Vados. Or even some of the other guys, uh, angels. Some of those angels don't even look like they're fighters, bro. Like the uh, Universe 9 one doesn't look like he throws hands, really. Um, you know. In Ultra Dynasty, we don't even fully know if it if it is. like, Or apparently they don't know amongst mortals. Because even the Grand Priest was like, yo. He's thinking. Whis is thinking. They're, they're fascinated by this. So, who knows what it is with mortals. And... Who established this hierarchy? There's so many other things I can say about all of that. But the evidence I look at it, I look how powerful Jiren is. I look how much more is to be shown. I look how Son Goku continues to develop rapidly within this tournament, as with a lot of characters have at this high level of competition. This reminds me of a uh, evolution video I did based on Tortico. Um well like over a year ago now. But that's what this tournament is doing, and it's had Characters like Khalifa, uh, Kale, and others develop uh, exponentially, you can say. Even Kaba developed in this tournament. So, that's my thoughts on it. I would love to hear what y'all thoughts are on there. There's much more that can be said, but there's not that much evidence. And I don't think we really have to talk. We can look at what's been established. He's more powerful than God's destruction. 
I don't see why it would it would be a jumping leap to have Jiren be Angel level. Now, does that mean he's beating Whis and Vados? Probably not. And some of the higher, more powerful angels? Probably not. But Jiren is that dude, man. He is powerful. I mean, you had the Supreme Kai Shen say he's simple. He's strong, pure and simple. He's clearly the most powerful dude we ever faced. Beerus was sweating. A lot of them dudes were sweating. All right? They were paying attention to this. This is that next level stuff. So, unexpected one, like, comment, subscribe. Tell me y'all thoughts and talk with y'all later. Peace.